Hey, what's going on guys? It's Chimney Swift here and welcome back to another video. Now, before we get into Dead Rising 4 and start slaying some zombies, I wanna let you guys know and disclose that this is a sponsored video. So I wanna give a big thank you to Lenovo for sponsoring this video, as well as hooking me up with the uh, Y710 Cube Gaming PC for free, which will be showcased in this video. And I'm gonna be talking about uh, the features of that product in this video because honestly, it's a really, really awesome sort of portable desktop. Um, so let's get into it and I'm gonna show you guys some of the cool features. All right guys, so let's take a look at this thing. Now, the first thing you'll probably notice and honestly, the first thing I noticed when I unboxed this thing was the form factor of the case. It looks sweet. It's like a cube, which is why it's called the Y700 uh, cube. This one's the Y710, but the form factor is just awesome. You got the red lights, the really cool angles, um, and it's just, it, it looks really, really cool, and it has a rather small footprint, which I like as well. Um, you know, in a gaming space, you want your stuff to take up as little room as possible, so that's one of the reasons I like this. You'll also notice that not only is it small, but there is a carry handle on the very, very top, which is just super cool. Like, even when I was pulling it out of the box, my hand just immediately was just like, oh wow, there's a handle here, and I pulled it out, and it was just, it was super easy to carry. I know a lot of desktops, even the one I use personally, uh, they're like heavy, you gotta like carry them by the bottom, but the Y700 come with this form factor, and it's got the handle on the top, so it makes it super portable, and really, really easy to carry. So obviously having like the ability to transport your system around is super nice, especially if you're somebody that likes to maybe take your computer over to a friend's house or whatever. But what's really important is what's inside the computer. Like you guys know that, that like what's inside is what matters. And the really nice thing about this computer, the Y710 and the whole Y700 series is that it's, you know, it's built for gamers and it's, specific, it's specifically built for gamers obviously that want to play anywhere. But when you're plugged in, you're gonna be running, like these computers have the latest processors, the latest graphics cards, and they definitely have plenty of RAM. Um, and so basically what this means, if you if you don't know anything about computers, what this means is it allows you to play any game you want on the highest settings. So another thing I wanna mention, and this sort of touches on what I was just talking about with you know what's inside the computer is, when you're checking out, if you're purchasing this computer for yourself and you're checking out, you know, before you even get to that stage of like, you know, put, like buying it, you can actually go ahead and customize the specs that you want. So it is, it is customizable, it is expandable, and you know, there are, there are options that you have when purchasing these computers, which is really, really nice. You're, you're not locked into just like one thing, um, you know, or you're not being forced to just buy like the, the absolute top of the line. Like you can customize and pick and choose what you want. So for somebody like me, who's a YouTuber, uh, you know, I game a lot. I do a lot of video editing. I've got a lot of multitasking going on, a lot of different programs running that have, you know, high intensive, um, you know, CPU usage and all that stuff. Uh, a computer here like the Lenovo 710 Cube is going to really, really, really help you out if you're gonna be doing anything like that. Specifically for gaming, obviously, but even just normal use, um, whether you're just browsing the web or you wanna watch movies or maybe you're editing or working on like an animation, like whatever you want, like this computer is gonna have the power for that. And you know, that's really important. Like I've used computers in the past. I think we all have come across this where you're just like sitting and you're waiting for a program to open or you can't switch between programs and things freeze up. Like it's, you that that's usually due to the fact that that computer doesn't have enough power, uh, whether it's memory or processing power or graphics power, whatever. But you know, these computers can definitely handle that stuff. And if you guys wanna know the exact specs of the computer that I'm showing you right now, I'll put that information down in the description below so you can check those out. All right, so with all that being said, if you guys do wanna check out the product, if you wanna check out the 710 Cube, uh, the Y710 Cube, excuse me, you can click on the link in the description down below. It'll take you right to the website and you can shop around and check it out. Honestly, in my personal opinion, um, these were, you know, these computers are very, very high end for a very, very decent price. So, um, that's all I'm going to say. Let's get into some Dead Rising 4 gameplay starring me killing zombies with ultra graphics. So let's do this thing. Yo, what's going on guys? Simnus of here and welcome to some Dead Rising 4 gameplay. I have never played Dead Rising, any of them. So I am in for a treat. This is the second... Well, actually, it's like the first little level here. I already went through the tutorial, which is basically just slaying zombies. I just want to kill some stuff. And by kill, I mean zombies. Come on. Okay, just slow down, Nancy Drew. I don't want to get shot, okay? Yeah, Nancy. All right, here we go. We're sneaking. Can I choke this guy out? 
What are you doing? What am I doing? I'm doing work. That's right. Okay. Got this guy. What? Uh, no, no, he's just sleeping. He's just sleeping. Yeah, yeah, just chill, Nancy Drew. He's just sleeping. No, no big deal. So we can take photos with V. Take a picture of Nancy Drew. Rank C. What? Zoom in. Getting points. Terror, horror, drama. What is this? What is this? What am I photographing? There's dead bodies on the ground. It's, you know, now would probably be a good time for a selfie. Yeah, bro! Yeah! D! That was a pretty good selfie if you ask me. I don't know. Look at this. There's questionable activity going on behind me. You can see who's in the photo. I like it. Oh! Should've got that one. Dang it. Uh oh. Cutscene. Way to give yourself away. Nice. Uh oh. Wow! Now we know what's going on. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh. Frank, it's a zombie. It's a zombie, zombie Frank. Punch him in the face. Are there you, you go. Okay? My doctor says it's an ongoing process. Uh. Try that door. I'll see what I can do. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, right here, right here. This large wrench. <gasps> My first weapon. Give me this. Am I supposed I to break through here? Panel. The only way out is to open all the cells. Yep. Why? I guess I gotta kill these. Oh, I can't break him. She's gonna do him for me. Here we go. You guys ready to bash some zombies in with a wrench? Let's do this. Wait, wait. Oh, yeah, here we go. Boom, boom, boom. How do you like that metal, huh? Undead. Stupid undead. Oh, yeah. Everybody dead? All right, we're good. Clear. Uh oh. I don't care about this shirt. Who cares if it's got blood on it? Whatever. That's what laundry's for. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, ah. This is a good game for like releasing frustration. I feel like I I do like this menu music. So festive. Bring it on! I got some sort of taser baton charge thing. Hold your horses. Need food to restore health. There we go. Get that water. Do it. We got coffee. Give me the coffee. There. Okay. Zap them. Yes. Oh, there's a lot that are coming out here this time. This thing's powerful, dude. I feel like a superhero with this thing. Yes. I like that little thrust at the end that he does. Oh, careful, careful, careful. Taking some damage. Oh, I think he just poked him in the butt. Like yeah! Hey, we did it. I'm coming oh. down. I, I, I'm like covered in blood, dude. All right, time for a selfie. Blood-filled selfie. Here we go. Yeah! I forgive oh. you. This is way better than mini golf. Woo! <laughs> Rexy, all right. Wow. <laughs> she called me out on it too. I just read love Selfie stuff. time. Hey! <laughs> it's so creepy. <laughs> All right. Yeah, and the only way forward is through this chamber. Oh, what? okay. We can't get through well. Incinerate the zombie. How? Well, she's uh, still in there. Purge. Uh oh, I forgot to lure her. Let's lure her into the fire. Interesting. Big piece of meat. Feasting time. Oh gosh, this is horrible. <laughs> this is so bad. Oh man. Wait. She's still alive? Sorta? Kinda? No? Who the wants heck? Barbecue? No? No one? Do I do it again? Frank, this is some atrocity level shit going on here, and the best you can do is crack wise. That is unfair. I have photographed things and thought about things. Selfie time. Hey! Be far away. Okay, here we go. Photos. Photograph. The are all the same. Yeah. Big family, you think? Shut up. Oh my gosh. He's so insensitive. Oh, we can open the fridge. Feeling hungry, my friends? Grab a Snickers. Wait, what is this? Lettuce? 
pills for lettuce? I feel like headache pills would be better than just a head of lettuce. I don't know. That's just me. What we got here? Milk? Although milk, can, you can't beat milk, man. Photos. Need photos. Can't Copy beat Brinkley. milk. All right. Well, that's creepy. What a shot. Oh, yeah. That's really good. They're going to be testing some kind of bioweaponized. Oh, what is she doing? Story and get out! I couldn't just. I couldn't just. Stay calm, Vic. That's what I said. Stay fucking calm. Now you put us both in danger. You're just gonna leave her? Just use her? We for need to what? get out of here. Do you understand me? For your pictures? Your stupid pictures? I'm a She's not a human anymore, though. Do I report? And if you can't do the same, if you can't take yourself out of the picture, then you should get the hell out of here. Unless you're taking a selfie, then you can be in the picture. Go, go, go! Uh oh, this is gonna be bad. Oh man. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching this gameplay footage of Dead Rising 4. It's been really exciting, actually. But yeah, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and once again, thanks to Lenovo for sponsoring this video. Uh, if you guys want to find more information on the product, be sure to check the link in the description below. But yeah, guys. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.